And we are ready for the start. They're off in the Kentucky Derby. Java's War was off to a slow beginning. A good start for Verrazano and Falling Sky. Falling Sky is the early leader. And now it's my lucky day. And coming through on the inside is Golden Sense. And Palace Malice is right up there, too, in the early mix as well. Then it's Oxbow to the inside. Vijack is on the far outside. In behind them comes Longshot Giant Finish. Frack Daddy Extreme outside. Then will take charge. Normandy Invasion rides the rail as they begin that wild scurry into that first turn. And then it's a length farther back to overanalyze. Lines of battle is right there to the outside of horses. Golden Soul. And then comes Orb, who is third last as they make their way to the back stretch. Ahead of My Lud and Rosie Napravnik. Revolutionary and Calvin Burrell are on the rail in slow starting Java's War. A 45 and one half mile. An extremely fast pace set by Palace Malice and Mike Smith, who lead the way up the back stretch. And an unexpected early leader here is Palace Malice. Verrazano is three lengths behind, running in second. Vijack, Oxbow, and Gary Stevens are on the rail. And Kevin Krieger has golden sense off the pace today. He's fifth as they move for the far turn. The Normandy Invasion, followed by It's My Lucky Day. Down toward the inside is Charming Kitten. After that comes Giant Finish. Nothing yet from Orb. He's still about 15th, but he begins to move up on the far outside. Palace Malice is the leader. He set a tour at pace so far and the pack is catching up quickly through on the inside is oxbow and normandy invasion is storming home and they're into the stretch and normandy invasion has taken the lead on the outside orb is coming with giant strides in the center of the track and here comes Orb on the outside now to take the lead as they come down to the 16th pole. It is Orb in front from Normandy Invasion. My loot and Golden Soul between horses down to the wire. Orb has won the Kentucky Derby for Shug It was Golden Soul. Revolutionary came late on the inside. And then it was Normandy Invasion. And it was Orb today in the Derby. His final time was 2 minutes, 2.89 seconds. Early at the top of the stretch circles the field. And Joel Rosario knew at this point that he had dead aim on the leader Normandy Invasion. I'm sure he, he wasn't sure that he had anybody coming from behind him, but he knew he had the leaders. All he has to do is keep Orb, who's struggling here. He's tired, they're all tired at this point in the race. Keep him straight, keep him together. Joel Rosario is one of the strongest young riders since Lafitte Pin Kai, and boy, does he keep him together entering the stretch. What a year for Joel Rosario. He won the $10 million Dubai World Cup. He wins the Kentucky Derby. He rode this horse in the first five races of his career. What a reunion. And what disappointment also for Johnny Velasquez, who had a choice to ride Verrazano or Orb. He chose to ride Verrazano, and he watches from back in the pack Rosario win it. Covered with dirt, Joel Rosario doesn't mind a bit, and he is alongside Donna.